Hey everyone, so I want to tell you something. I wanted to flip grid and I just thought to myself, wow, I watched all your videos from yesterday and it was so cool to see your book talk power really shining through. You were definitely an avid reader now. And you were all using the sentence stems. It's about, I like the part when, because, and it was just so cool to see that. Nice job. All right, so we're gonna finish then the rest of the gossy today. And you're gonna do this again on Flipgrid and you're gonna talk about the end of the book. All right, let's get started. One morning, Gossy could not find her bright red boots. She looked everywhere, under the bed, over the wall, in the barn, under the hens. Wait, did you catch that? Was that a short vowel too? <sighs> eh, eh, eh. It is. It's a short vowel. It's E. Nice job. Under the hens. Gossy looked and looked for her bright red boots. They were gone. Gossy was heartbroken. Look at her little tear. She's heartbroken. Then she saw them. They were walking on someone else's feet. Great boots, said Gertie. Gossy smiled. Gossy is a gosling, a small yellow gosling who likes to wear bright red boots almost every day. Look at her, she's sharing with Gertie. That's so kind of her. All right, so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go back to Flipgrid and you're gonna look for today's Flipgrid post and you're gonna comment on what, on the ending of this book. Remember, you can use sentence stem, it's, it's about, and I like the part when, because, and I'm gonna reply, and I'm so excited to see what you say. All right, bye.